to be my Drugstar curly hair routine. So throughout the past couple weeks, I noticed that my curly hair routine is all from the drugstore. And I thought to myself, like, have I done a video on this? And I don't think I have. All the products I'm showing you guys in this video are my new Holy Girl products and I love them so much. My hair is in the healthiest state that it has ever been in. Because of these products, it just makes them pop. It just makes them look so good. I can definitely tell that I'm gonna be using this routine for months and months because my hair has never looked better Yesterday my hair looked like this but with a little bit of frizz and it was like fifth day hair and I was like I could have kept that wash and go longer, but it was dirty and I needed to wash it before we get started Make sure you guys thumbs up this video if you like it and subscribe if you like me We are currently trying to hit 150k on this channel and also I'm almost at 50k on Instagram So if you're not following me in there, make sure you follow me if you want to But yeah guys without further ado, let's get started with the video is actually fifth day hair and it really does not look that bad i think this is like the best wash and go i've ever had i'm gonna try to repeat the whole thing that i did for this video for deep conditioner today i'm gonna be mixing together some coconut oil and the honey and yogurt hydrate and repair protein power treatment i mixed these two together to get this wash and go and it came out so nice that's what i'm gonna be doing again today coconut oil i'm pretty sure you have it in your house if you don't you can find it at like trader joe's you can get it on amazon and i'm pretty sure the drugstore has it as well i'm putting that all over my hair to start with so I'm just gonna be splitting my hair into two I actually forgot to melt this so I'm gonna put some of this in a bowl and I'm just gonna melt it really quick okay so I melted it enough where it's melted <laughs> but it's not like boiling hot there's still some chunks in there last time I did this my hair was flourishing it felt so good if you ever just have the time to do a mask I really do suggest it honestly make up huge difference in your wash and go even if like you're busy you could still do a mask you could do a mask while cooking cleaning for your face as well i'm just gonna distribute the coconut oil onto these two parts of my hair and then you're gonna see what i do after <music> So now I'm just going to be taking a little bit, well, a lot of it, of this mask, about that much. And I'm going to be putting that on top of my hair. And you could do either one by itself. You could do an oil mask by itself or a mask like this by itself. But I really like to mix it together to get the best results. Shea Moisture has some of the best masks for curly hair. I'm making sure to really concentrate that on my ends. It's only my second time using this mask, but I could already tell that it's going to be one of my new favorites. Okay, so I just put my hair up really quickly and now I'm just gonna let this marinate for maybe like 20 minutes Might as well do a face mask. I always do that when I'm doing like a hair mask I'm gonna be taking my Shea Moisture Dragon's Blood and Coffee Cherry Instant Rebound Mask This is for stressed skin and I didn't wash my face today or anything yet So I don't know how well this is gonna work, but we're just gonna put it on because why not? So I'm back out of the shower and I tied my hair up in this t-shirt and that's what I always do after I wash my hair because a regular towel will cause way too much frizz. So my favorite drugstore shampoo is the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Grow Shampoo. It has peppermint and apple cider vinegar which really helps to cleanse your hair. So this is for damaged hair and since it has castor oil it helps to help grow your hair out so that's what I've been doing. It's the only shampoo I've been using. And for conditioner I've been using the OGX Renewing and Argan Oil of Morocco Conditioner. I actually discovered this because of Jasmine. She uses this in her hair just to style it and I saw it at my local Bed Bath & Beyond so I was like hey why not try it and I think it was like seven bucks for this huge bottle I love it because it gives you a lot of slip which makes it really easy to detangle your hair so some conditioners are too thick and it makes it really hard to detangle and really get in there so I've been loving this I'm definitely gonna repurchase this because it's cheap lately I've been taking the Maui Moisture Thicken and Restore Bamboo Fibers Certifying Mask this is for weak and brittle hair and this also has castor oil in it which is a great hair growth agent so I've been using this on top of this now we're just gonna be styling the her she's pretty wet right now i like to style my hair when it's wet to a point where it's like not dripping how wet this t-shirt is I hate when my hair touches me so the first part that i'm going to be taking to style my hair is the maui moisture thicken and restore bamboo fibers conditioner so you know these two go together this is a conditioner but i also use it as a leave-in i just love this product so much i love this line so much that i reached out to my moisture and they sent me a whole bunch of stuff look at this picture 
they sent me so much stuff and I'm overwhelmed and I'm, I'm set. I am set for the next year. I actually just finished this one, so I'm opening up this one. But this is gonna be my first product. And this product is also watery, so it makes it really easy to distribute it throughout your hair. And then for each separate side, I take a little bit more. And I also like to split my hair and apply more product. Now time for the next product. Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Style Milk. This is for thick and curly hair and this is a throwback. If you guys have been watching my channel since I started, you would know that I used to use this line all the time. Later down the line, it stopped working for me, but I recently just tried it again and I, I love it. So we're gonna be using this, especially because it's winter time and my hair is hella damn dry. I don't really go as crazy with this product as the last one. I really feel like they reformulated because this product has a lot more slip than what I remember. last product I'm gonna be using a mousse this is the design essentials almond and avocado curl enhancing mousse this can be found in the drugstore and I absolutely love this product I actually didn't buy this myself from a drugstore I got in like a curly hair gift bag kind of thing when I went to an event but I love it this is my favorite curly hair mousse ever it works so well I never knew a mousse could be for curly hair until this came into my life so I just take my hair and put it like that I take some about this much and I just try to coat my hair look at that shine yeah and now we're gonna scrunch and you want to hear this noise i don't know if you guys can hear it on camera it makes like a and my hair is pretty defined right now but you guys know i love to finger coil taking the parts that frame my face the most and just finger coiling those So my hair is all done. She is ready to be blown out. If I don't sleep on my hair, like if I have to wash my hair during the day, I do like to diffuse it. So I'm going to be taking my Diva Curl diffuser. And I'm not going to be showing me doing that in this video because that's not a drugstore product. I'm pretty sure you can find a diffuser at any drugstore. So I'll see you guys when my hair is fully dry. Alright guys, so this is my finished hair look after I finished diffusing it. My hair is very light and bouncy. I think this is my favorite curly hair routine that I've ever had. My hair has never felt healthier because I cut out heat a long time ago. When I do straighten my hair, it's once a year. So this is the healthiest my hair has ever been. Plus these amazing products. I would recommend these products to anybody. And I love that they're drugstore, so they're definitely affordable. Guys, that's basically it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Let's get to 1,500 likes. Subscribe down below if you are not already. Make sure to all follow me on my social media if you're not already we are so close to 50k on instagram i think we're like 100 away which is crazy because like we're close to 150k and you at 50k on instagram so make sure you follow me on that that's basically it and i'll see you guys very soon with a new video peace i love you bye <laughs>